Now let's proceed to the timer block. A countdown timer in emails draws users' attention to a certain event. It shows recipients how soon the event starts or how soon the sale ends, which normally results in a 9% increase in ROI for e-commerce. How do you use the timer block? Just pull it into your template. Set the end time and the time zone. And choose what you want your users to see when the timer expires. Zeros or a notification image where you say the sale expired. Find powerful and engaging examples of timers in emails on our blog. Now let's learn what the menu block is and how to use it. We think there is no need to explain why menus are important for emails. We'll just say that about 10% of users click on the menu tabs in emails. It is very easy to add the menu to emails with Stripe. Just choose the way you want it to be displayed. Either menu items or menu icons, aka images, or menu items along with images. Of course, you add your URLs to each and every menu item. Then you can work on the menu design, including alignment, text styles, and tabs location. You can also hide certain menu tabs on mobile devices if you like. The HTML block. You need it just in case you want to add custom elements to your emails. With no need to code the entire email from scratch, drag the HTML block in your template. Then click on it to open the HTML code editor. Paste your code and see how it looks along with other elements of the email. You can edit the code if necessary and see the changes right away. The carousel, accordion and form blocks are meant for the AMP content, which, according to our personal experience, increases conversion by up to 520%. But what is this MPA content for? It allows placing a number of banners on one screen and leaving feedback on your products, services directly in emails. Now let's get a closer look at the carousel block. You upload a necessary number of images of a certain product item, like the same product in different colors. Users swipe images or click the optional navigation arrows to move the slides. You can apply carousel for banners, product cards, etc. Or even for utilizing email gamification. Work on the design of the carousel, including the slides preview. Enable autoplay if you want the images to swipe automatically. Here we can also see the accordion block. Accordion, also known as the hamburger menu, is a list of headers that expand collapse the content section upon user interaction. In the accordion sections, you place texts, image carousels, videos, and multiple product cards along with CDA buttons. Design this email element the way you like. And finally, the form block. This is an interactive form that enables users to leave comments directly in the email. What's in it for you? Interactive forms collect 5x times more feedback compared to regular external forms. You track NPS, collect feedback, and collect users' data, like their names, email addresses, and contact information, upon their consent, of course. Once users fill out the form, their responses are sent to the Stripe data service. Only you have access to the storage, no external tools required.